Good evening and welcome to Jim Monley's World of Weather. You clicked on to Long Range Weather Forecast discussion for October 19th through 31st. A major, a major pattern change will be underway across North America for October 19th through 23rd with a broad deep trough over the east right here and we have a deep uh, ridge off the northwest coast or off the west coast. Rainfall expected to be above normal across the Gulf Coast states caused by a subtropical flow. The heaviest rain expected from the western and central Gulf states. Some of the moisture could be spread northward across um, the southern Appalachians. Okay, now we're going to look at the pattern for October 22nd to 26th. And the pattern is forecast to be amplified. And we can see here that uh, <coughs> This is in agreement with the NAO going negative and the PNA going positive, and the ensembles indicate a decent spread across the west, across the west in regards to the western North America trough. Now we have a, a trough here, ridge here, like I showed you here, and another trough here. So this is a very amplified pattern. The ensembles in indicate uh, the deterministic runs from the GFS move the ridge off the northwest coast that a terministic from the, the European maintain a ridge over the northwest. Now the climate forecast system version 2 agrees with the GFS solution, to, uh, the terministic solutions, and runs in respect to the western North American ridge and has below normal heights over eastern North America. And we're going to look at it right here. This is the GFS and you can see we have um, below normal heights here, above normal heights across this area, and we have near to below normal heights here. And you can see we have a northwest flow going across here. Now um, the pattern during the period is maybe winter like as far as we have um, energy coming in from the Pacific going across western Canada and dropping down across the Great Lakes and they're called clipper systems and they'll be impacting the northeast and Great Lakes region. Okay, now we're going to look at the pattern for October 27th to the 31st, and the pattern still looks amplified. We have our trough here near Alaska. We have a uh, but normal, above normal heights and a ridge across Western North America, and here we have this deep anomalous trough here across the East Central U.S. So the pattern is, is quite similar to the previous period. However, there are significant differences in the deterministic GFS and the the GFS deterministic runs are in poor community, and the latest deterministic GFS is similar to, the, to its ensembles and maintain a trough over the central and eastern U.S. The earlier runs that are deterministic have the trough over the Rockies, allowing for a weak ridge over the southeast. So during this forecast period, Well, this is for the first forecast period. This is for, I didn't show the maps, for the 22nd and the 26th. We have above normal temperatures here, below normal temperatures for this region. And for precipitation, look for below normal precipitation here, and above normal precipitation for the northern middle Atlantic and the northeast. Now for October 27th to the 31st, forecasting above normal temperatures across the northwest and below normal temperatures for the plains to the east coast and for precipitation looking at below normal precipitation for this region so that is the long range weather forecast discussion for october 19th to the 31st thank you for coming jim on these world of weather and have a good day